All right, let's do some async action. Oof, I don't like these choices. This to me is like high likelihood of losing MMR. Well, I don't, it's not MMR. Losing your slot machine number. Uh, I've been very disappointed in Hercules lately. It's like you get the one proc on 20 very early. Very early, because you just lose fucking fights early. And then you never get the six unless you get Chrono Crystal. It's like I just never have the math work out in my favor there. So, probably not Hercules. It's probably Bruni as, as much as I... I don't know. I could do Daedalus as well, but... Daedalus can be okay. It, uh... You know, I just take whatever... Even if it's a two-cost treasure, it's fine. But... It's certainly more, probably more interesting to play it than Bruni, but Bruni probably has a call here if I don't want to lose. If I don't want to hire, like, I don't know, Bruni I lose a lot with too. It's like, the evil characters just ain't it. They just ain't it. The good characters are so much better, but at least early on. Later on, it evil is fine, but by that point, your stat boost is pretty relevant. kind of wish at level 6 that it doubled the bonus again. It still wouldn't be that OP, but it would like make it feel a little bit better. Uh, I guess we just do the Bruins. The problem with the Bruins is if I want to actually use the hero power the whole way through, it's going to be scam, but if I don't, like, the the problem with the demons is if you don't find the five cost demon, which lately I haven't been, you just fucking lose. And pivoting out of demons is tough. Uh, I often get trolled down slay, which is horrible, I am adamant about that. I know on the beta right now it's apparently okay because the woman of the moon is bugged, but... Or maybe not bugged, but in my opinion, bugged with the ridiculous stat lines I'm seeing. But other than that, like I've 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 gone down the sleigh route enough to know that it is not consistent. It's a great way to lose your slot machine points. Just trying to think, if I do Daedalus, we can run into the Fafnir problem of not getting an early combination. Which will really put us behind. Uh, this, uh, I don't know. I think we just do the brune. I don't know. Let's do Daedalus. Let's do Daedalus. Okay. We have a good start here. It's not good for getting a two cost treasure, but it's good for surviving with our lack of tempo. What we'll do is we'll just do this and that, and that's a pretty hard board to beat, no matter who we are. We'll just uh, roll with that for now. Taking out a Leprechaun, granted they had a pretty bad board. Could do the Cat Angel and this, that's like pretty okay. Just do it like that. If we want to double up on that, you know we could. But I think it's better that I spread the stats out here a little. Alright. Good start. I've had mixed feelings on this. I've had some games where it does pop off, but it's anti my hero power. It's awkward to lock right now. I think we just search for a two. I mean, it's a two. Could also sell one of these units, but this is a good enough shot for me to lock considering it has puck and impatient farmer. So we'll do that. 
Ooh, that fucking sucked. I should have. Well, I mean, how am I going to predict a dick that they have that? They have that? If I would have known that, I would have done it like that, maybe. Well, it wouldn't have mattered, really. There's nothing I could have done there. Oh, well. Uh, we'll go like this. Ten. Was the break point, but realistically that's gone up by, since then. <clears throat> so we'll just go with 15, I think. All right, we'll get our first, we'll get a double treasure three. That's pretty good. And we're winning fights. That's very good signs. I could, uh... I, I might as well do the star catcher since I have puck. Normally I would take Storybrook, but we got the upgraded puck. We should do that. I could do Wizard Hat, I think. <clears throat> Just give you some food so you can keep that. I'm like... Probably should buy that too. Just drop that then. We'll admit that the boosters are better at this point. Not gonna lock the angel. Don't want to get trolled down that line. We want to find dandelion now, or star girl. Mm, crab could be okay too, just as a unit that does happen to be a good unit. So we'll do it like that. don't like these. I really do want a dandelion. Yeah. How bad do I want a dandelion? I could take that. I don't have enough angel. I don't really want to go down that route as a thing. Yeah, I'll go like that. I guess I could take another one of these. It's not horrible, huh? Considering I got that. Don't really need the blue belt. Maybe I should take it anyway, though, because if we do end up doing Oberon shit, you know, if we never find Star Child, we will want to Oberon. And this is going to be increasingly harder to find. Just having one in my pocket is fine. Horrible fucking... Oh my god. That literally could not have gone worse. Holy shit. Whatever. Fuck you. Game. Piece of shit game. Whatever. Uh, could be better than that. I guess. Sure would like a dandy line, but we've got some stuff here. Dandy. Almost didn't see it there. Uh, Seer's Fear with this could be okay. I mean, if, if that'd be a way for me to, like, scale the Oberon once I get an Oberon. I don't think we need the doubles here. I'm only giving up a minor amount of stats, so I'll keep the double. Just for the hell of it. Actually, just put that in, I think. I mean, it's not horribly worse than those. 
Hopefully you don't have... Okay, you're already dead, wow. Oops. Alright, Starchild, we would like to find you. Do I really do another puck? That seems like a little bit ridiculous, I think. Okay, tripling that is fine. Double caster or reflector? Let's do the double caster. Now I got. I can, like, do some real stuff here. I would do that. I mean, 11 attack, sure. We don't need a Star Child again if we just get the Oberon eventually here, so. And this is pretty good. I would like that thing to actually just have stats. Uh, let's do this so we can get ahead to Oberon. Actually, this would just be better if I could just get an Oberon. I have no need of Star Child at the moment. Like, for sure, that would just be better. Damn it. I wanted to keep the stats. <laughs> Alright, we're on six. I forgot that that actually double casted, so I, I rocketed ahead on experience there. Uh, we'll just take a peek. No harm in looking. That one more time. 20 by 2 means I'm. Yeah, we do want to find that Oberon, though, like ASAP. I'm not going to upgrade these. Oberon is one of those that seems hard for me to find a lot of the time. I think we... I mean, there's always Titania, which might be what we want instead. I think we would just... Because the Titania actually scales off Starcatcher. So we'll probably just do that. Still do that. We do want to buy these type of things. Man, that is a lot of stats. I'm going to do that. They have a lot of stats. Not a whole lot else for me to do this turn. Yeah, I just get a lot of stats here, it's fine. Okay, there's Titania. I'll lock that. That'll go there. Well, at least we tie, but we don't get the permanent stats there. You'll go there. Double haste, sure. Oberon, yes. Yes. Fuck yes. Okay. How do we want to do this? We actually want to go like this. Get as many of these going as to start with. I mean, this should get almost a full thing, and they might shoot before we re we remake those. I think that's good. This needs to go there now. I want to double cast something if I can. Not that. I will cast that though, because what better 
I'll never find a better time to do that, I don't think. That was unideal. At least we get these to resummon, though. That's what you want with this type of build, resummon those stars. It didn't matter you're going to hit a star mirror matchup, but in the mirror, though, definitely a bluebell freaking demolishes, demolishes the mirror matchup if they don't have it. If they're running, oh shit, I fucked up. All right. Missed some stats there. I didn't realize that this is like the best one to, to find. I know there's one that's better, but this one doesn't cost mana and it costs a bit less. We want wings. If it can significantly fuck over any of these, I would take it. That'd probably be the only one, but I don't think my whole turn being dedicated to that makes a whole lot of sense. I guess I would do this. I could really high roll a number of things here. <clears throat> All right, those weren't really it, but uh, we could do Midas. Toy Dino just helps me tie. The rest is just whatever. Although Dame Gothel maybe. No, not really. Eventually Dame Gothel would be good. If I do Midas, I'm saying, you know, we don't get any uh, treasures here, but... I don't necessarily need any more treasures than what I have here, to be honest. Like, a four cost might be... Okay. I'm not... Yeah, I don't think I actually need treasures, so... I probably should just take Midas, because then I can upgrade these pretty easily, and then just focus on casting spells. So I think that makes sense. That is actually a really good spell to cast. Put that on the puck. The one on the right, at least. Haha. -ha. Probably do it like that, I don't know. We want this one to get the more, more of the stuff. We could go like this, it's probably best. Maybe like that, I don't know. Yeah, th we only need to last three. And this one can die just to add charges to the, uh, the initial ones here. Because we're Midas, we don't really want to do that. Okay, upgrade you. We don't... I could probably just double wolf this, honestly. That seems like pretty good, actually. We got a pretty good build here, I would say. Perfect. That's exactly the ordering we want. Wait, how did that thing still have a shield? The fuck? It must have been in a, a whatchamacallit. Yeah. Whatever the case, they're dead. Yeah, they had it behind one of those. Double haste, don't mind if I do. Triple that, don't mind if I do. Why not quadruple haste? Don't really want to cast that. Don't need that. Don't need that. You're screwing me. I just have to take what I can get here at a certain point if it's just like not going to give me anything. Another, uh, 
another uh, book would be nice just to put on another unit. But it'll probably be unnecessary. We've got such a nut set up here with the star build. Really, I should probably put the puck to the left there. Like, that's probably more valuable for me to get that dying than it is a free shot off. I don't want to cast that. <clears throat> I do want to cast that. Just in case. Okay, I don't think we need more than that many wolves, though. <laughs> Keep looking for a Titania triple, I guess. Definitely would like to triple the Titania. Ooh, this could be the type of build that fucks me over. Never mind. <laughs> Get fucked. There we go. Stats there, I suppose. Damn it. Bastards. Could double my dying breath here. I don't think that's actually worth me just statting these units up, though. I'd rather just spend money on spells. Told you we wrecked the mirror. Holy crap, we wreck it. 15 damage, baby. I will take that. Gosh, that sure was a smooth one. I would say results not typical on Daedalus. I think I've had a lot of bad Daedalus runs, but that certainly worked out. We, like... Immediate frog into immediate booster into immediate really good treasures that all kind of synergize together into stars. We had direction the entire way through. And then we just high rolled a lot of stuff amazing well there you go that's the uh, <laughs> that, to me that's the ideal uh, star build you know you just you get the three three turn bluebell charge you don't have to hold a gold every turn and then you put a wolf in one of these so you can like if the if the you know if it's resummons we didn't actually run into any heavy resummon builds, but if we did, we'd still be good into them, because we would resummon an entire thing of stars. So I will take it. As always, thanks for watching, and until next time, peace.